Hi, my name is Olivia. It's the third day of October and the third day of 80s week, which means we are continuing on with our theme by talking about the television in the 80s. Television in the 80s revolutionized TV watching in America because cable television was invented, which gave consumers more of a selection to watch. Some popular shows in the 1980s were The Golden Girls, Magnum P.I., The Wonder Years, The A-Team, and Knight Rider. Make sure to binge watch some of those. On to the announcements. Good morning, Seneca Valley. My name's Kaylee, and here are your announcements. SST is canceled for today. Don't forget to sign up for this month's Lunch and Learn on Thursday, October 4th. A representative from Pennsylvania's Higher Education Assistance Agency will be joining us to discuss this financial aid process. Students must register to attend online through their Navion student account. Also, register and attend this week's college rep visits. Reps will be visiting from Westminster, Clarion, Duquesne, Ohio Northern, and more. Students must register to attend through their Navion student account. Seneca Valley is holding Waiver Week. Representative, representatives from Cal U, IUP, Slippery Rock, Penn State, and Kent State will be here during the school day on October 15th to 19th. For Waiver Week, seniors take, can take advantage of free application and guidance on their potential admissions decision. Students planning to attend must stop by the guidance office to sign up for a time slot and receive requirements needed to attend. Another 80s television act, Pat Save Jack, Say Jack was a weather forecaster in 1980, but became famous when he helped make television's greatest show, Wheel of Fortune. Wow, that fact sent me spinning. Back to the announcements. Attention Best Buddies participants, if you are planning to be a peer buddy or an associate, member applications are due by October 10th. You must register online at www.bestbuddiesonline.org in order to participate. Please contact Mrs. Vu or Mrs. Mays if you have any questions. Now, let's check in with Zach to see what's for lunch. General So's chicken. Thanks, Zach. Medical Careers Club students interested in learning more about Medical Careers Club are reminded that there will be a meeting after school this Tuesday in the Senior High Library, IHUB. The meeting will begin at 3 p.m. Students will need to arrange transportation home afterwards to plan to take the activity bus. The IHS Homecoming Dance will be held in the IHS Cafeteria Gymnasium on Saturday, October 13th from 7 to 10 p.m. Tickets are $15 and will be sold during all lunches beginning September 26th through October 10th. One dollar from each ticket will benefit the Student Assistance Fund for IHS students and families. Guests of IHS students must be in grades 9 through 12. Guests from another school must complete a guest permission form that is presented at the time of ticket purchase. Guests from the high school must be registered in the time of ticket purchase. Students can attend only one dance. No 8th graders will be permitted. Attention ninth grade skiers and snowboarders. It's that time of the year again and ski club is approaching. To become a member of the middle school ski club, pick up a packet and fundraiser from inside the intermediate office or print them from Mr. Flood's website. Money, money and hoagie orders are to be brought to the intermediate office no later than 8 a.m. Tuesday, October 9th. If you have any questions, contact Mr. Flood in the middle school room 228. One final 80s TV fact. In 1986, the average household had the television set for seven hours a day, with Sunday being the most popular night for viewing. And that's it. My name is Olivia. These were your announcements. <laughs> My name's Kaylee. <laughs> My name's Olivia. And I dressed like a minion today. <laughs> so.